Michael Landon, born Eugene Maurice Horowitz in 1936, had a family life that was far from the idyllic worlds he later portrayed on TV. Despite his difficult upbringing, Landon became known for his roles as Little Joe in Bonanza and Charles Engels in Little House on the Prairie. His characters were charming, hot-headed, wise, and loving, reflecting his own complex personality. Delve deeper into the life of this actor and the challenges he faced while working on his iconic TV shows. Michael Landon, who was born Eugene Orwitz, chose his professional name out of the phone book when he began his acting career. As a child, Landon was quite introverted and found solace in his own company, often going for long walks and indulging in his love for comic books. The actor's mother, Peggy Orwitz, struggled with depression and even attempted suicide at one point. This undoubtedly caused a significant amount of stress for Landon, who was still a young boy at the time. Despite the challenges he faced at home, Landon persevered and went on to become a successful and well-respected actor in the entertainment industry. Throughout his career, Landon starred in several popular television shows, including Bonanza, Little House on the Prairie, and Highway to Heaven. His talent and dedication to his craft earned him a legion of fans and a place in television history. Despite his success, Landon remained humble and dedicated to his family. He was married three times and had nine children, whom he loved deeply. In his personal life, Landon was known for his kindness, generosity, and strong work ethic. In Little House on the Prairie, Landon portrayed Charles Ingalls, a loving father and husband who faced numerous challenges while raising his family in the American West. The show was a hit with audiences and remains a classic to this day. Landon's portrayal of Ingalls was warm, sincere, and relatable, making him a beloved figure in American television. In Highway to Heaven, Landon played an angel named Jonathan Smith, who was tasked with helping people in need. The show was uplifting and inspiring, and Landon's performance was heartfelt and genuine. Throughout his career, Landon's work resonated with audiences and left a lasting impact on the entertainment industry. His talent, dedication, and kindness will always be remembered and cherished by those who knew him and by the countless fans who loved his work. Despite the challenges he faced in his personal life, Landon remained a positive and inspiring figure. His legacy continues to live on through his work and through the memories of those who loved him. The actor's ability to connect with audiences and inspire them with his performances is a testament to his talent and his enduring spirit. Michael Landon, the actor known for his roles in classic television shows, had a difficult childhood experience with bedwetting that continued into his teen years. His mother, in a misguided attempt to address the issue, would hang his soiled sheets outside to dry, causing Landon significant embarrassment. As he entered high school, Landon's struggles continued, and he became unpopular with his peers. Consciously failing his grades, he sought solace in sports, where he found success in track and javelin throw. His athletic prowess earned him an athletic scholarship to the University of Southern California, providing him with an opportunity to turn his life around. Despite his academic struggles, Landon's natural talent and dedication to sports allowed him to excel in track and field. His achievements in high school sports were significant, earning him recognition and respect from his peers and coaches. The scholarship to USC was a testament to his hard work and determination, and it marked a turning point in his life. Through sports, Landon found an outlet for his energy and a sense of belonging. His experience in high school sports shaped his character and work ethic, contributing to his success as an actor in the years to come. The lessons he learned on the track and field continued to resonate with him throughout his career as he became a beloved figure in the world of television. Michael Landon's dreams of pursuing higher education were cut short during his freshman year when a sports injury left him with torn ligaments in his arm. This unfortunate event led him to abandon his scholarship and look for alternative means to support himself. The actor took on various jobs to make ends meet, including working as a stock boy and unloading freight trains. These manual labor jobs were a far cry from the glamorous world of acting, but they provided him with the financial stability he needed to survive. Despite the challenges he faced, Landon never lost sight of his passion for acting. He continued to pursue his dream, taking on small roles in local theater productions and television shows. His perseverance paid off, and he eventually became one of the most beloved actors in Hollywood. Throughout his career, Landon starred in several classic television shows, including Bonanza, Little House on the Prairie, and Highway to Heaven. His performances resonated with audiences, and his legacy continues to inspire aspiring actors to this day.
In the end, Landon's journey from college scholar to manual laborer to successful actor is a testament to his determination and resilience. His story serves as a reminder that setbacks and obstacles can be overcome with hard work and a never give up attitude. Michael Landon's acting career took off after a friend's audition at an acting school led him to discover his passion for the craft. In 1959, he was cast as Little Joe on the classic television show Bonanza, which brought him financial stability and widespread recognition. As Little Joe, Landon quickly became a fan favorite, and his portrayal of the character was instrumental in the show's success. However, his reputation on the set was not always positive. Landon was known for being difficult to work with due to his narrow vision for scenes and his insistence on things being done his way. Despite this, Landon's talent as an actor was undeniable, and he went on to have a successful career in both television and film. His legacy as an actor continues to resonate with audiences today, and his performances in Bonanza and other classic shows and movies are still cherished by many. In the end, Michael Landon's passion for acting and his unwavering dedication to his craft helped him overcome any obstacles he faced and solidified his place as a beloved figure in the world of entertainment. Michael Landon was known for his willingness to stand up to network executives, even if it led to tension. This assertiveness established him as a creative force in the industry. One of his most famous roles was on the classic Western show, Bonanza. The show, which aired from 1959 to 1972, followed the adventures of the Cartwright family in the fictional town of Virginia City, Nevada. However, by 1972, Bonanza had lost some of its popularity. Additionally, the death of Dan Blocker, who played Haas Cartwright, was a significant blow to the show. These factors ultimately led to its cancellation. Despite this, the show remains a beloved classic and is still watched and enjoyed by audiences today. It's worth noting that Landon's career didn't end with Bonanza. He went on to star in and produce other successful shows such as Little House on the Prairie and Highway to Heaven. His talent and creativity continued to shine through in his work, making him a respected and admired figure in the entertainment industry. After the end of the successful Western series Bonanza, the actor Michael Landon had grown into a seasoned writer, director, and performer. His family's fondness for Laura Ingalls Wilder's Little House on the Prairie book series inspired him, and he decided to pitch the show to NBC. The network loved the idea, and soon, Little House on the Prairie became a beloved classic. During the filming of the show, the production underwent a significant transition. Initially, the show was filmed at Paramount Studios, but later, it moved to MGM Studios. This move brought about an unexpected surprise for the cast and crew. As they explored the new location, they stumbled upon the famous yellow brick road from the classic movie, The Wizard of Oz. The Yellow Brick Road was a stark reminder of the rich history of filmmaking at MGM Studios. It was a fascinating discovery that added a touch of magic to the set of Little House on the Prairie. The show's transition from Paramount to MGM was a significant turning point in its production, and the Yellow Brick Road became a symbol of the show's enduring legacy. The actor's confidence in his abilities as a writer, director, and performer was evident in the success of Little House on the Prairie. The show's wholesome, and heartwarming stories captured the hearts of audiences worldwide, and it remained a beloved classic for generations. The show's transition from Paramount to MGM was just one of the many challenges that the actor faced during his career, but he handled it with grace and professionalism. In the end, Michael Landon's contributions to the world of television were significant and enduring. His work on Little House on the Prairie was just one of the many ways that he left his mark on the entertainment industry. From his early days on Bonanza to his final role on Highway to Heaven, the actor's impact was felt by audiences and industry professionals alike. His legacy continues to resonate with fans of all ages, and his work will undoubtedly be cherished for generations to come. Michael Landon, the actor famous for his role in Little House on the Prairie, experienced great success with this classic show. Lasting for nearly nine years, it consistently ranked in the top 30 ratings, making it a beloved staple for families during primetime television. The show's finale was particularly dramatic, with the exterior sets being blown up in a memorable scene. This event marked the end of an era for both the show and its fans, leaving a lasting impression on those who had followed the series since its inception. Tragically, Landon's success was soon overshadowed by a personal health crisis. In 1991, he was diagnosed with liver and pancreas cancer, which led to severe abdominal pains, 
This devastating news shook both the entertainment industry and his fans who had come to know and love him through his various roles on television. Despite the challenges he faced, Landon remained a resilient figure, continuing to work and spend time with his family until the end. His legacy as an actor and a family man remains an inspiration to this day, leaving a lasting impact on the world of television and the hearts of those who knew him best. Michael Landon spent his final days at home, surrounded by his loved ones. The actor, known for his roles in popular shows like Bonanza and Little House on the Prairie, had been diagnosed with pancreatic cancer. Despite undergoing treatment, he passed away on July 1, 1991. In his remaining days, Landon cherished every moment with his family. He understood the fragility of life and wanted to make the most of his time. This realization led him to say, somebody should tell us right at the start of our lives that we are dying. Then we might live to the limit every minute of every day. I say do whatever you want to do now. There are only so many tomorrows. After his passing, Michael Landon's ashes were placed in a mausoleum near the grave of his TV father, Lauren Green. This touching tribute highlighted the close bond they had shared on screen and the impact they had made on each other's lives. The actor's legacy continues to resonate with audiences, as his classic shows remain popular to this day. His work has transcended generations, inspiring and entertaining viewers of all ages. By embracing life's challenges and cherishing every moment, Michael Landon has left behind a powerful message that continues to resonate with audiences today. In the world of television, few names resonate as strongly as Michael Landon. Born Eugene Maurice Orwitz on October 31, 1936, in Queens, New York, Landon began his journey in Hollywood as a contract player for Columbia Pictures. However, it was his role as little Joe Cartwright in the popular Western series Bonanza that catapulted him to stardom. Running from 1959 to 1973, Bonanza became one of the longest-running television shows in history, with Landon's character becoming a household name, but Landon's talents extended beyond acting. He also became a successful director, writer, and producer, creating and starring in the heartwarming family dramas Little House on the Prairie and Highway to Heaven. These shows, which aired from 1974 to 1983 and 1984 to 1989, respectively, further solidified Landon's status as a beloved figure in American television. Throughout his career, Landon received numerous accolades, including several Emmy nominations and a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. His work transcended generations, leaving a lasting impact on audiences and shaping the television landscape for years to come. Despite his success, Landon remained humble and dedicated to his craft. He once said, I've always believed that if you put in the work, the results will come. And for Michael Landon, those results were nothing short of extraordinary. His legacy continues to inspire and captivate audiences to this day. Born Eugene Maurice Horowitz on October 31, 1936, in Queens, New York, Michael Landon's life took a dramatic turn early on. His father, a theater actor and manager, encouraged his love for storytelling. At nine, the family moved to Collingswood, New Jersey, where Landon's dyslexia was diagnosed. This learning difficulty, however, did not hinder his passion for acting. Landon's mother Peggy played a significant role in his career. She enrolled him in acting classes, and he soon began appearing in school plays. His natural talent and charisma were evident, and he started securing small roles in films and television shows. In 1955, Landon landed his first major role in the movie I Was a Teenage Werewolf. This breakthrough led to more opportunities, and he appeared in various productions, including Telephone Time and The Restless Gun. A key influence in Landon's life was director and producer David Dortork. In 1959, Dortork cast Landon as Little Joe Cartwright in the iconic television series Bonanza. This role catapulted Landon to stardom and solidified his place in television history. After Bonanza ended in 1973, Landon created, produced, and starred in Little House on the Prairie, a heartwarming series based on Laura Ingalls Wilder's books. This show became a cultural phenomenon and further showcased Landon's storytelling abilities. Throughout his career, Landon was inspired by his own life experiences and the people he met along the way. His ability to connect with audiences and create memorable characters left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Ever since Michael Landon was a young boy, he was drawn to the world of entertainment. At the age of nine, he started his journey by appearing in a local church production. His natural talent and charisma were evident as he delivered a memorable performance that left a lasting impression on the audience. 
Driven by his passion, Landon continued to explore various aspects of the arts. During his teenage years, he discovered a love for writing, and even sold his first script to a television show when he was just 17. This early success fueled his desire to pursue a career in the entertainment industry. In his late teens, Landon decided to focus on acting. He moved to California and began auditioning for roles. His determination paid off when he landed a part in the popular television series Telephone Time. This opportunity not only provided him with valuable experience, but also solidified his commitment to his craft. Throughout his career, Landon faced numerous challenges and setbacks, but his unwavering passion for acting and storytelling kept him moving forward. He once said, I've always believed that if you put in the work, the results will come. This mindset, combined with his natural talent and dedication, made Michael Landon a beloved figure in the world of television and film. From his early days in church productions to his successful career as an actor and director, Michael Landon's passion for his craft was the driving force behind his accomplishments. His legacy continues to resonate with generations of fans, inspiring them to pursue their dreams and make their mark in the world of entertainment. Born in 1936, Michael Landon grew up facing financial struggles. His father's unstable job situation often left the family in difficult circumstances. Despite these hardships, Landon found solace in acting and writing, pursuing his passion with unwavering determination. As a young man, Landon faced skepticism from the industry. He was told he was too short and not handsome enough to become a successful actor. However, he refused to let others define his path. Landon honed his craft developing his skills in acting and writing, and soon began to make a name for himself. One of Landon's earliest challenges came when he was cast in the TV show Bonanza. Initially hired as a guest star, Landon's performance was so impressive that the producers decided to make his character, Little Joe, a series regular. But this success was not without its struggles. Landon was often at odds with the show's producers, who wanted to take the show in a different direction. Determined to maintain his artistic vision, Landon began writing and directing episodes of Bonanza, giving him more control over the show's direction. This creative solution allowed Landon to showcase his talents and solidify his place in the industry. Later in his career, Landon faced even greater challenges when he created, wrote, and starred in the hit TV show Little House on the Prairie. The show was a massive success, but it was not without its obstacles. Landon worked tirelessly to bring his vision to life, often working 16-hour days to ensure the show's success. Despite the challenges, Landon remained committed to his craft, and his resilience paid off. Little House on the Prairie became one of the most beloved TV shows of all time, and Landon's performance as Charles Ingalls is still remembered fondly today. Throughout his career, Michael Landon faced numerous obstacles, from financial struggles to industry skepticism. But he refused to let these challenges define him. Instead, he used his creativity and determination to overcome each hurdle, leaving behind a legacy that continues to inspire and entertain audiences to this day. Michael Landon's career took a significant turn in 1959 when he was cast as Little Joe Cartwright in the TV show Bonanza. His clean-cut, all-American image quickly captured audiences' hearts, making him a household name. Co-star Lauren Green once remarked, Michael had a unique ability to connect with people, which made him a natural fit for the role. In the early 60s, Landon showcased his writing and directing talents on Bonanza, further solidifying his status in the industry. However, it was his role as Charles Ingalls in Little House on the Prairie that truly catapulted him to stardom. The show, which aired from 1974 to 1983, allowed Landon to display his range as an actor and storyteller, blending drama, comedy, and family values. Critics and audiences alike praised Landon's heartfelt performance and storytelling in Little House on the Prairie. As TV Guide put it, Landon's portrayal of Charles Ingalls is a timeless testament to the power of family and love. His work on the show earned him several Emmy nominations and solidified his place as a small screen legend. Following Little House on the Prairie, Landon created and starred in the popular series Highway to Heaven, which aired from 1984 to 1989. The show, which focused on themes of faith and redemption, further showcased Landon's ability to connect with audiences and deliver powerful performances. Throughout his career, Michael Landon's work transcended generations and left a lasting impact on the entertainment industry. His ability to create and star in groundbreaking projects, as well as his talent for storytelling, earned him a special place in the hearts of millions. As his Highway to Heaven co-star Victor French once said, 
Michael was a rare talent who truly cared about his craft and the people he worked with. Michael Landon, born Eugene Orowitz in 1936, was an accomplished actor, writer, and director, best known for his roles in Bonanza, Little House on the Prairie, and Highway to Heaven. Landon's artistic vision and process were deeply personal, often drawing from his own experiences and worldview. Growing up, Landon faced many challenges, including a difficult relationship with his father and about a polio. These experiences shaped his perspective and informed his work, leading him to create complex and relatable characters. He once said, I like to write about people who are real, who have problems and fears who have warmth and affection. Landon's approach to acting and directing was hands-on and collaborative. He worked closely with his cast and crew, fostering a positive and creative environment on set. His directing style was known for its emotional depth and attention to detail, with a focus on storytelling and character development. In Little House on the Prairie, Landon's creative vision was evident in his portrayal of Charles Ingalls, a loving father and husband who faced adversity with determination and grace. Landon's performance resonated with audiences, and the show became a cultural phenomenon, enduring for nine seasons. Landon's writing and directing credits include some of the most memorable episodes of Little House on the Prairie, such as I'll Be Waving As You Drive By, and The Quality of Mercy. These episodes showcase Landon's ability to tackle complex themes with sensitivity and nuance, exploring issues such as loss, forgiveness, and redemption. In Highway to Heaven, Landon continued to explore themes of faith, hope, and redemption, playing an angel sent to earth to help people in need. The show was a testament to Landon's belief in the power of kindness and compassion, and it remains a beloved classic to this day. Michael Landon's artistic vision and process were deeply personal, informed by his own experiences and worldview. His work resonated with audiences, leaving a lasting impact on television and popular culture. Michael Landon, an actor who left an indelible mark on the television industry, was born Eugene Orowitz on October 31, 1936. Throughout his career, he contributed significantly to the evolution of storytelling and inspired many within and beyond the entertainment world. Landon's work on Bonanza, which aired from 1959 to 1973, showcased his ability to captivate audiences. As little Joe Cartwright, he brought warmth and humanity to the Western genre, paving the way for future family-oriented dramas. Barbara Hall, a television writer and producer, praised Landon for his ability to connect with people on an emotional level. In the late 1970s, Landon created, produced, and starred in Little House on the Prairie, a series that would become a cultural phenomenon. Through this show, he explored themes of family, community, and perseverance, leaving a lasting impact on both viewers and the industry. Landon's influence extended beyond his on-screen performances. He was known for his hands-on approach to storytelling and production, often rewriting scripts and working closely with cast and crew members. This collaborative spirit inspired many, including actor Dean Butler, who played Laura Ingalls Wilder's husband Almanzo on Little House on the Prairie. Butler once noted, Michael was a mentor who taught me the value of story and character. Moreover, land and storytelling often delved into complex emotional territory, addressing topics such as loss, faith, and redemption. His ability to tackle these themes with sensitivity and grace has been celebrated by industry experts and fans alike. In the end, Michael Landon's contributions to the television industry remain significant. His work as an actor, writer, and producer helped shape the landscape of family-oriented dramas and left a lasting impact on the techniques and trends within storytelling. Michael Landon, known for his work on Little House on the Prairie and Highway to Heaven, was a devoted family man off-screen. He married three times and had nine children, some of whom followed in his footsteps and became actors. Landon's strong family values often translated into his work, where he portrayed loving fathers and husbands. Landon's personal interests included horseback riding, which he often incorporated into his shows. He was also an avid painter and enjoyed creating art in his free time. In addition to his career and family, Landon was passionate about philanthropy. He was involved in various charitable organizations, including the Make-A-Wish Foundation, for which he granted numerous wishes to children with life-threatening illnesses. Landon also donated generously to St. Jude Children's Research Hospital and was a supporter of the American Cancer Society. Landon's personal values of family, kindness, and generosity were evident in both his personal life and his work. He was a man who truly cared about making a positive impact on the world and inspiring others to do the same.
Despite his passing in 1991, his legacy continues to live on through his work and his philanthropic efforts. Michael Landon, known for his work on Little House on the Prairie and Highway to Heaven, left an indelible mark on the television industry. His ability to bring characters to life, making them relatable and endearing to audiences set a high standard for actors. For those aspiring to follow in his footsteps, Landon would likely advise them to stay true to themselves and their craft. He once said, if you're going to stay in this business, you've got to love what you're doing and you have to do it with passion or you won't survive. In terms of future contributions, Landon's legacy serves as a reminder of the power of storytelling and the impact it can have on viewers. Actors today can continue to contribute to this legacy by choosing roles that challenge them and resonate with audiences. Landon's career also highlights the importance of versatility in the industry. He not only acted but also wrote and directed, showcasing his range of talents. Aspiring professionals can take a page from his book and explore different aspects of their field to find their unique strengths and contributions. In the end, Michael Landon's legacy is one of passion, versatility, and the power of storytelling. By following in his footsteps and staying true to their craft, aspiring actors can continue to make their mark on the industry and inspire future generations. Michael Landon's journey in the entertainment industry was nothing short of inspiring. Born Eugene Orwitz on June 36, 1936, he started his career as a struggling actor, but his passion and determination led him to great heights. Landon first gained recognition in the late 1950s for his role in the TV series Telephone Time. However, it was his portrayal of little Joe Cartwright in Bonanza that catapulted him to stardom. His innovative acting style and enduring charm captivated audiences, making him a household name. In the 1970s, Landon created, produced, and starred in Little House on the Prairie, a show that became a cultural phenomenon. His ability to tell compelling stories that resonated with audiences, combined with his entrepreneurial spirit, revolutionized the television industry. But Landon's impact went beyond acting and producing. He was a trailblazer in many ways, breaking barriers and pushing the boundaries of what was possible in television. His work transcended generations, leaving a lasting impact on the entertainment industry. Throughout his career, Landon faced numerous challenges, but he never gave up. His perseverance and creativity were the driving forces behind his success. He once said, you have to believe in yourself and you have to be willing to take the chance to be better than you are. Landon's legacy continues to inspire aspiring actors, writers, and producers around the world. His story is a testament to the power of creativity, passion, and perseverance. It reminds us that with hard work and dedication, we can all leave our mark on the world. Let's take a moment to remember the talented Michael Landon he was an actor who left a lasting impression on the entertainment industry. His work in shows like Bonanza and Little House on the Prairie captured the hearts of millions. Landon was born on October 31, 1936, and started his career in the 1950s. He quickly became a household name, known for his charm and acting abilities. His characters were complex and relatable, making him a fan favorite. Throughout his career, Landon showed his versatility as an actor, director, and writer. He even created and starred in the popular show Highway to Heaven. His work continues to resonate with audiences today, a testament to his enduring impact. Now, we want to hear from you. What are your favorite memories of Michael Landon's work? Share your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to like and share this post to keep the conversation going. Let's celebrate the creative spirits who have shaped entertainment. By subscribing to our channel, you'll get access to more content that highlights the contributions of talented individuals like Michael Landon. So, take a moment to subscribe and never miss a chance to learn more about the artists who have left their mark on the world.